Hey guys, welcome back to another HTML programming tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you guys how to detect a button click in HTML. So this is super fundamental, basically any website you go on is going to have some kind of button which you can click. So I'm going to be showing you guys how we can actually find the click handler. And just to let you guys know, this doesn't actually, is not exclusive to buttons like any sort of element, divs, anything, they use the same sort of technique. So let's say in HTML you've got your button here. We've just created a simple button. It says click me and I can click on it like so. So to find the click, to get a event when we click it, we actually want to go to JavaScript because that's usually where we're going to be handling everything. So we have to create a script.js file first and then what we're going to do is just link it in. Pretty standard stuff. And what we actually need to do is defer it so that it actually gets loaded once all the HTML is initialized, just so that we can actually identify this button in JavaScript itself. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to give this button an ID. So I'm just going to call it button. And then what we're going to do is we're going to get this button object within JavaScript. So we can do that by using the document.getElementById function. And then we're just going to type in the ID which we gave the button here, like so. Get it here, and now you can see we've got the button in JavaScript. So I'm going to console.log this, just to show you guys that we have in fact got the button. If I go to console, and you'll see if I do this, it's this button specifically, and you can see it's definitely got it. So once you've done that, okay, once you've done that, we can attach the handler by using button.onClick and you'll see there's also a lot of other events so we can do on close. Uh, we can do I think on hover is one okay um, on drag over things like that and yeah there's a lot of there's a lot of events so you can pick the one you want this was just to talk about on click so let's talk about that and what it wants us to do is assign a callback to this so callback is just a function and yeah this is our function and we just assign it to this so every time this button is clicked it's going to run the code inside this function and now what I can do is just write whatever I want in here so I'm just going to write the button that's clicked like so and there we go now you can see whenever I click this we get the button was clicked like so now one more thing, you can also take in the event. This passes in an optional parameter as an event and this just has information about the click. So it's not too useful when it's just a button on click, but it's got everything about the mouse. So if you say this was like a div and it was a whole screen, then we could actually find where it's clicked specifically on the screen and we could use that information to do something else. But yeah. That was how you detect clicks in JavaScript and HTML. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in a future tutorial. Bye.